So Barney, what changes are happening with right to work checks, DBS checks and identity? Yeah, it's an exciting time. So what we're seeing is um, the DBS right to work schemes. There's been discussion for probably 18 months about they're changing their method for ID verification. So what was announced literally this start of this year, first week back at work, um, and they're saying that now we can start to use digital identity verification to verify what used to be a very manual process. So we used to have to ask the candidate to appear with them with their face, with their document, either to their employer or to their safeguarding officer if they were applying for a football coaching role. No longer is that the case. Now they can, both those schemes will allow individuals to verify themselves online using identity service providers like ourselves. So it gives us um, an extended business opportunity in the world which is still offering pretty poor customer experience. It was driving everyone to that manual approach. Clearly COVID has changed that and there were some small changes during COVID that allowed this method via video, but now this is a wholesale change for the industry. So an exciting time. Um, and we see huge opportunity in this for employers, background screening companies, tenancy vetting agencies. So yeah, very exciting. Is this the same service you provide today for your current customer base? Yeah, to an extent it is. So right now we offer an array of identity services to our banking clients, our gaming clients, our sharing economy clients and what they can do is through an intelligent back end select an identity journey they want a candidate to undertake to verify them dependent on the risk in that transaction or the regulations that that business must meet. Under the new scheme, the GPG 45 with government guidelines and these schemes developed by the DBS and the right to work bodies, they've established very definitive journeys where individuals must undertake certain things in terms of evidence they provide, biometric data, um, background checks on data assets and those sort of things. So we do offer very similar today. This is going to be a very much a hard wired verification to meet a regulation, but it's very much the same. It's the same, same software, same system, yeah.